Casey and the Sports Doctor here with state champion <laughs> crew team, Stonington High School, Tyler Page, the coach, and they are gonna take us out onto the water. Now, as you know, Sports Doctor, usually if I'm on the water, I'm on a nice sailboat with a cocktail. <laughs> What am I in for today, Coach? <laughs> You're in for a trip, buddy. It's just gonna be a little bit different than being on the boat with a cocktail. Now the key to this thing is doing it in time. So you two, we're just gonna have you two row together and see who, who can follow. All right, ready, All right. set? No, 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 Coxon's the one that tells you what to do. They're not the worst I've ever seen, but they, there's definitely some potential there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Or goes the other way there, Casey. There we go. Nice and simple, huh? Simple, yes. Easy, no. Some good experience for them. I, I guess they really appreciate the sport now. It's a pretty tough sport, and I guess they found that out the hard way. One of these days, that blade will go in the water, buddy. There you go. This is really not easy. They did pretty good. Um, better than some of my the novice uh, last year. I Definitely better than me. See, the misconception is that the coxswain just yells stroke the whole time. She really doesn't. Maybe it could help you, Casey. They were pretty good. I mean, not taking any spots on my boat. Just watch his, watch his body in front of you. <laughs> you have the exact opposite. We're, trying, we're going to set up down the race course here. I think they took my spot. I think I lost it. We're going to get this thing moving a little bit. Ready? Go. <laughs> Oh, that's what's much harder than I thought. <laughs> I can't match them! There's definitely some room for improvement. They got some potential, but need more strokes on the water to get better. Yeah, we can show you how tippy the boat is. No, thank you. Just move it back and forth real quick. Yo, what are you doing here? You people are mean! <laughs> Pretty choppy. They kind of, uh, just kind of stabbing the water with the blade. It wasn't not very effective. All right, guys, we're just gonna take it to the bridge. Give it a little bit of juice so they can see how fast it kind of kind of is with six guys going. I got this blade on the water thing down. If this is all I had to do, I might be okay. Having them was different, but it was an experience to remember. There you go. Now we're getting it together. Yeah, that was really. I was good there. You guys were awful. Sorry. <laughs> I know it was your first time on the water, but like you didn't even get the blades in the water some of the time. <laughs> we're gonna do what's called seat racing. So we take a couple people out of the boat and then put a couple new guys in and see if it goes faster. And get out of the boat? Yeah. That really that works for me. Kill it guys. You know, I've always thought it was very it was very elegant to watch a boat in sync. But having now spent just a few minutes in one, I can't, I can't explain how beautiful that is to watch because five minutes in a boat helps you understand this is like poetry you're watching right now. It's, right. it's elegant. Right. If, you ever, if you're out there at home and you've said to yourself, you know, that doesn't look so hard, you're wrong. If you're, again, if you're at the gym and you're like, I banged out five miles today, you didn't. I don't think you guys at home realize how tough this is, how hard these kids work and just, and. It's a sensational, sensational sport, and it's a lot of fun, too. I want to thank you guys for having us. Absolutely. Thank you.